Like, if it rips, <laughs> it rips everywhere. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hello, welcome everyone. This is the GHGY with Kristen. I'm Kristen. Not Kristen. Oh. <laughs> All right, this is Pahalange 3. Now, now you might be wondering. There's four people here. I am here. wondering. Yeah. Can you explain? Yeah. So, for those who are tuning in, um, for this one, which there's a really good chance that you are, because, uh, you know, small known people watch it. So, okay, either way, for those who are watching, um, this is a thing where we have a small limited amount of time where we must, uh, write, produce, edit, a film in a small amount of time, and we face each other, um, and it's a fun time, so... You might be thinking, huh, there are four people sitting here. How should we break up the team? Let me tell you this much. It's Jen and Kristen versus me and Cleverbutt. I want a Cleverbutt. <laughs> Alright, so... Here's the plan. So usually we don't break up into teams until we do the pitch. However, this is a special case. So we're still going to do the same setup. So I'm going to present a gimmick. We're going to spend 30 minutes, an hour. How long do you guys want to spend planning and presenting? Ask Cleverbot. <laughs> I forgot. Cleverbot is very important to this. How? Long, you got this. Should we plan for? Oh, should we plan for? <laughs> Do you want to be my? Well, I have a few issues with that. <laughs> if you do, you want to be my girlfriend? She is with the clever butt. Whatever I say. It's that whatever I say, so 11 o'clock, that worked for you okay. guys. Okay. <laughs> okay. Alright, break. Oh, make a lookbook, that's what we want. A look. Oh, I forgot! Oh, I need to tell you the gimmick, don't I? What's yes. the gimmick? The gimmick is... The the whole premise. Yeah, give us, give us a little... Let's go and roll. What, what, what were the last two gimmicks? Oh, yeah, last two were Random Generator, the last time was music, this one is just a phrase. Ready for this? Just don't stress. Can you say that more clearly? Just don't stress. Hmm? Make well, a pitch. About it. I yeah. like it. Just make something. All right, let's break. Let's Our legs. All right, let's do. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go. Right. So when I think of happiness, I think of excitement. So, what kind of film are we going for? Like, it's on stress. Like, I feel like it should be satirical. Okay. Tell me what you see. Yeah, you should, you should like, open the door and look at what he's doing. He's just talking to himself. No, the whore I will. Don't <laughs> Is he doing the mic on? Why isn't Hal doing this? You, know, you can hear, you can hear his like, secrets. All right. Why doesn't Hal have someone? I mean, Pete. Why doesn't Pete <laughs> have anybody? No, I'm not Starfire. My name is Sarah, remember? No, I don't. Right. I so don't remember. What do we want? What? Oh, no. <laughs> You said you were a boy, and now you're Sarah. I don't understand. The lines aren't matching. I never said that you did. 
You did, you did, you just did. You just fucking uh, need you to talk. What do we want just to look like? I need you to talk to me. <laughs> Can we actually film it? Is that think so? Yeah. So who who's Jeff? What's my I didn't even mention your soul. <laughs> you pick a coin. Oh, um, pick one has a toes. Alright, go pick the other. What it would be if it would be Oh us. yeah. Or do you want someone else? I don't know if we can do that, can we? Well okay. let's figure out what we're doing first. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Why clever, why, why? Okay, do you mean you turned off and plugged your husband? Or is she? Or Patrick? Who the fuck is Patrick? Who is Patrick, man? I'm just trying to plan for this. on a good progress we're, we're starting to communicate some more we're having a few seconds just to stop and communicate you know think take it all in me on my end clever bot on their end we're we're focusing this on um the stress that happens whenever you don't answer a question so we're lingering on that we're lingering on that um what do you have to say clever bot what do you have to say clever bot just checking your name is Remy, right? <laughs> Clever Bob with its jokes, you know. Uh, I, I, sorry. <laughs> My name's not Remy, okay? <laughs> Why do I keep on having to say this? Oh my. No. <laughs> you see, Clever Bob. <laughs> Clever. Clever with its jokes. Yeah. Sometimes, me and Cleverbot, you know, we try our best, we do our due diligence. Sometimes there's just a language barrier. I don't. <laughs> Cleverbot. <laughs> Why have you betrayed me, Cleverbot? They finished. I'm not even. Cl I haven't even started. You're gonna lead me. Oh. Were you done? Ah. Huh. They're waiting for you. That's. It's a mess. How do we know if we're what we're doing is right and what we're doing is wrong? And in the end, who knows? And and with with this everyday s society asking you to do everything, it, it just you know. How are you gonna get there? How are you gonna get there? Let's see. Clever, but how, how are we going to get there? Come on. Come on. Come on. Finish the third paragraph. <laughs> Just
It's 11 o'clock. You guys ready? No, it's not. Um, it is. Let me just the pitch. That's okay. Let me just finish the sentence. I mean, we're ahead of time. We already finished our book, book yeah. technically, yeah. so that's all we need. Yeah. See you guys. Microeconomics is. Yeah, check out the Peter. Peter. Peter, it's 11 o'clock. Oh, no! Cleverbot! Oh, come on, come on. Sorry, I gotta got get my partner up in here. Why didn't you warn me, huh? Why didn't you warn me that it was 11 o'clock? Tell you what? It doesn't even know. You ready? Because they done. Yeah, we ready. I said 11. We're going to do 11. Let's go into 223. It's 11.01. That's fine. Oh, 223? 223. 223. 223. 223. 223. 223. Ugh. I thought you meant 223 in the morning. I'm like, huh? Well, yeah, you I know. I ain't going until 223 in the morning. I think that's I will warn you. The lookbook is a little lacking in features, but that's okay. Hold on. Cleverbot just pointed out that TV's still on. We're good. Turned it on. Cleverbot got our back. Don't you? See you on the other side. See you on the other side. You guys got a look book? That looks like a hot dog. <laughs> I know, it looks like a nail. Thank you for coming to my concert. Thanks for attending my TED talk. <coughs> <I'm not. laughs> no shoes. <laughs> but share it to. Oh, blur that out. Blur out What's my email? email. And blur that out. You're not supposed to know that. Oh, <laughs> did you what? Don't Excuse me, about. sir. Don't look. Don't look at it. <laughs> I'll shunt it. There. I got it. Yes. That's illegal. Wait, that's illegal. I don't know that. Blur it out. Blur it out. Uh, how? Wait, did you send this one? Oh, no. Send it. Blur that out, too. Can you put the email up? It's like a freaking porn video <laughs> in Japan. At least we don't have to worry about your feet. Can you put the email up? You can get rid of the other app. I have no other or app. Is, is that a website? Um, Blur that out. That's for you to know and for me okay. to find out. Cool. Shant. <laughs> Got a little buzz buzz. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, hold on. Let me look. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, who's going first? Well, you already have yours up there. Yeah, just go. Let's have just go. Yours up here too. <coughs> All right, just go. You go. Okay, fine. Yeah, we'll sit that All right, way. so this is unanswered questions by me and your boy Cleverbutt or girl. Tell us in each situation how he was used. Yes. So first off, unanswered unanswered questions, right? That's the big question. That's how did we get to unanswered questions? So here's what happened. I was thinking, I'm stressing out over just don't stress, right? I was worried. And then I was like, clever butt. What's the first thing that comes to your mind when I say, you know, just don't stress? And you know what they said? They said, I don't feel like you answered my question. And I, I really thought about it for a second. I thought, you know what, that does stress me out. Whenever people don't, when people don't answer my questions, I get, I get frustrated, I get stressed. I'm like, dude, did they read it? Did they answer it? What's the situation? Are they dead? Are they gone? What's happening here? What's, what's the situation from here? And so then I sat down and I thought, okay, what's, what's some situations where some questions might not be answered. 
obvious one, texting, you know, what's happening, there, you know, and texting, and then you wait for like maybe five, ten minutes, twenty minutes, an hour, two hours, and it's nothing, nothing, I was like, I can do that, but then I remembered, you know, don't do that, so then I thought, I, I thought again, and I was like, screw it, I just asked Clever about it. So I asked Clever about, what do you think? And they got me nothing. So, um, I had a couple of philosophical questions about how we're all clever about, right? We're all clever about you and me. We got some footage of that, roll the clip. What's our theme with this film, Clever Butt? It's gonna give us a good answer. You're the clever bot. <laughs> you are the clever bot. The audience is the clever bot. That's what it tries to mean. It Clip played. Clip played? Yeah, played. All right, I wasn't sure about that. So, so then, after all of that, that made me think. This vlog line. Vlog line. Quarry. Frustrating, grieving student seeks guidance from an unknown or about an unknown future by writing a letter seem to seemingly nothing. Sorry, I didn't uh, reread this and uh, Cleverbot didn't point any of this out, so you could really just blame Cleverbot. With Corey growing to the ends of their wits, something must reveal questions before the answers get to them. Is the, the grammar's really bad there? Is that what yeah, yeah, we were it. laughing about yeah. it. Oh. Ouch. <laughs> Ooh. But so, so uh, if that doesn't make much sense, let me let me further uh, extend my thoughts on this. Corey, male or female name, perfect genius because I don't know what actors I'll be able to get. Their grieving student, you know, whether it be death or a recent uh, diagnosis with a um, with a disease or something like that, they seek guidance um, from an unknown entity. They're just writing it down. Maybe they'll find answers. And so, the antagonist here is the unknown, um, and the ironic twist to it is they are writing to the unknown, and in that process they're trying to seek out something. So, you know, lots of visuals and possibly writing. <laughs> I think ours is better. I'm just thinking about ours, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> okay, so, uh, I only have two more slides, so... The look, it's gonna be very moody, very warm tones, kind of harsh lights with this bluer look. It's gonna be nighttime most likely, if I have it my way. Um, and then again, more of these kind of uh, blue, um, blue orange textures, and also they'll be writing a book. So. Um, that's under my lookbook. I I promised it wasn't too good. Um, so it's not good at all. Terrible. Um, I'll see. Do you like this background though? I spend a little bit too much time on it. Yeah. yeah. Did you just paint it yourself? Uh, I I got some Uploaded tricks. Uploaded the PDF. No, nah, I I did some Photoshop stuff. Mm. Okay. Okay. So that's it. All right, our sex. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Cleverbot, for helping me out in this. All right, so just don't st <laughs> Anyway, so the my thought process here is when I first heard the phrase just in time, my brain thought that just was the name. And you somebody's just telling time. time. You mean just don't stress? Just was the name, yeah. Just in time. I'm getting there. Just is the name, and somebody's telling them, don't stress. Just don't stress. Yeah, just. So that's what we based on. Yeah. <laughs> Stop looking. <Okay. laughs> wow. You so, see me. So, anyway. our character's name is Protagonist. Just in time. Huh? So, first thing is she is stressed. Or, or he. Or he is stressed. Mm -hmm. And everything's just going wrong for them, you know? Um, so, with this Q. Hugh, Q. Hugh walking in down the hallway. They're walking the down the hallway. Taco Bell bag in hand, yep. laptop open in the other, backpack, in backpack on, back. on back, walking down, they're stressed, they're mumbling to themselves, damn it, I got a paper due at 11.59 and it's 10.30 and she walks into the bathroom, or he, she sees, or he, their friend, they, they see their friend, 
Mm-hmm. And they're like, hey, Just, why are you walking into the bathroom with a laptop? And then Just is violently shoving her Taco Bell, or we keep saying her because we can't. We're we not gonna originally go to thought it, look, we're going to say her because yeah. that's what we were going to say. Her. She's violently shoving her Taco Bell bag into the trash can. And she goes, oh. <laughs> she goes, oh, wow. Oh. I had $3 in my bank account. This Taco Bell bag was $5.29. Um, I got a paper due at 11.59 and it's 10.30. My hamster's sick, you know. So she continues she into the bathroom. Walks into the handicap stall. Handicap sits stall. down, puts her bag down, you know, opens her laptop and begins to shit violently. <laughs> <laughs> and um, you know, she's writing out her her three page paper for microeconomics. <laughs> what well, <laughs> you know? <laughs> and um <laughs> while this is going on, her friend who's still there is like <laughs> and walks out of the bathroom. So, then, um, she finishes one paragraph, yay, I finished, <laughs> while she's shitting. So then, somebody else walks into the bathroom with their poopery, ready to take shit. They walk <laughs> in, and they go, <gasps> throws the poopery, right, out of shot. walks, runs out of the bathroom, vomits <laughs> into a trash can, and then the poopery <laughs> Flying through the air, hits just in the head, and then she goes. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't have a visual for that, so I tried. Yeah. It. So, and then she's really happy because she can use it. She goes to use it, and it's empty. Empty, bro. It's just not her Why night. Would you even have Everything's that on going you? wrong. So then she finishes up her second or third paragraph, whatever, and then she gets an incoming call from her mom. Mother. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Her mother's not the hamster. <laughs> and she goes, Her mother died. <laughs> 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 so then, she goes, Hi, honey. She goes, Mom, it's not a good time right now. <sighs> Your hamster died. Sorry to tell you. Sorry to tell you. So that happens. So that happens. <laughs> <laughs> and then, so then... But that I'll, doesn't even matter. That doesn't anymore. even matter. Doesn't anymore even matter. Because what else could go wrong? Her laptop dies, right? So she goes to two percent, you know, two percent, whatever. She goes to pull out the her charger, charger <laughs> from her bag and searches for an outlet in the freaking handicap stall and, there and realizes no outlet. In there the is no outlet. There's no outlet. No outlet. So then, <laughs> to top this all off. She finds out there's no toilet paper in the bathroom. So, and then she just starts laughing because it's just so funny. <laughs> what a way to end her night. Yeah. Thank you for coming to our TED Talk. Yes. That was beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. The life changing. Well, since that's the case, fucking, fucking me, clever bot over here, I'm gonna fucking annihilate y'all. Why are you standing so Why do you look like a Pokemon trainer right now? Who? Yeah. You're like, me, clever bot here. <laughs> <laughs> clever bot, I choose you. <laughs> I can beat you guys. Because. Did you use two Pokemon because you guys have Pokemons? Yeah, do I get the double battle? <laughs> Wait, boy, you need the hat. Oh my god. Fuck. <laughs> it's time to duel. <laughs> I like the gym leaders. <laughs> I like the gym leaders who are like. Oh, you get Taco Bell? Yeah, I'm You're clever about to no match for Or you shit. wear Wendy's McDonald's? I want Taco Bell for I said Taco Bell. And then I'll be just. We need Taco Bell because we need the bag. You're so right. I'll get Taco Bell. <laughs>